So I just came across this intriguing project called Copy Party, and it's like turning any device into a personal file server. How wild is that? Wait, what? A personal file server? Like you can upload and download files over the internet? That's kind of a game changer. Exactly, and the best part? It only needs Python to run. No complicated setups, just run a simple script and you're good to go. That's super interesting. So what kind of protocols does it support? I imagine there are a lot. Oh, for sure. It supports HTTP, WebDAV, FTP, and even TFTP. You can literally choose how you want to share your files. No way. That's like having a Swiss Army knife for file sharing. So, does it have any security features? Definitely. You can set permissions on a per-folder, per-user basis. It even has password protection for shared links. Think of it like a vault. That's actually kind of neat. I can see people using this for all kinds of creative projects. What about mobile access? Great question. There's an Android app for uploading files directly to your server, or even an iOS shortcut you can set up. It makes it super user-friendly. That sounds so convenient. Can you tell me more about the upload process? I'm curious. Absolutely. You can just drag and drop files into your browser, and it even supports resumable uploads, which is great for larger files. Resumable uploads? That's a huge plus. You mean it can pick up right where it left off if there's an interruption? Exactly. It's like it knows to save its place. Plus, using the Update Uploader, it allows for parallel uploads for faster speeds. Now that's some clever tech. So how do you manage files and folders once they're uploaded? You have a full file manager interface in the browser. You can cut, paste, rename, and even batch rename files, which is super handy. Batch renaming? That's something I didn't expect, so it's really tailored for efficiency. Totally. And it can even create RSS feeds to monitor folders. Just imagine keeping track of uploads via a feed. That gives me chills. I can picture a scenario where someone might use this for a podcast or a music library. Exactly. And if you're worried about storage, it has features for deduplication to save space. How smart is that? Wait, deduplication? So if I upload the same file again, it won't take up extra space? Yep, it creates a sim link instead of a full copy. Super efficient for managing storage. That's brilliant. I didn't expect this system to be so robust. What else is unique about Copy Party? Well, it's got a really flexible configuration system using command line arguments or config files. You can customize it extensively. Customization really can make or break a tool. What other features set it apart? It has a built-in media player for audio files supporting various formats. So you can stream your music directly. A media player? So it's not just a file server, it's a media server too. This just keeps getting better. Yeah. And the audio player even has options for creating playlists. Just think of the possibilities. Wow, that's really cool. So, is it more user-friendly for individuals or suitable for small businesses? It's versatile enough for both. Individuals can use it for personal projects, while small teams can leverage it for collaboration. This makes me reconsider how I share files. What about security, though? Can it be exposed to the Internet safely? Great point. You can set up reverse proxies for additional security, plus you have options for SSL TLS. So it's safe to run even from home networks. That's reassuring. Absolutely. Just a little setup, and you're good to go. It's like having your own server without the hassle. I love how accessible technology is becoming. Have you tried setting it up yet? I haven't, but I'm itching to. It seems perfect for sharing media and backups. I'm definitely going to test it out. You should. I can't wait to hear about your experience. Copy Party sounds like a real winner. Definitely. I'll keep you posted once I dive into it. Awesome. Let's catch up again soon to share our latest tech discoveries.